So we have here Android 14 QPR2 Beta 1. There's a new update from uh, Google. We have this installed on our Pixel device. And uh, let's get deep dive into it. The features, the changes, which things are included in this update. I will let you know everything in this video. So stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end. The first one is a screen recording options. Here we have the option to record just for a single app instead of the entire screen. You have the option to choose the entire screen also. But this feature was not available until this update in android 14 this is so useful in some cases for example you're recording screen for a particular app then you can't do any multitasking but with by enabling this option you can do that very easily if you take a look at this privacy indicators if you enable this you have the option to see these options you have the option to customize this you have the option to close the app or you can simply manage the access and it works with every permission for example camera and microphone if you use the camera app and if you see that recent indicator click that and you will be able to extract that one of the major changes in android 14 is the at a glance widget you can finally disable the at a glance widget unfortunately i i, I was not able to enable this option because it's right now hidden and it's it could be enabled with the help of a flag i was not able to enable that unfortunately but if you're able to just check it out this is so amazing you can simply disable this option called at at a glance at to home screen and this is so good you can place your custom widget instead of at a glance and this is one of the most awaited features another one is the quarantine app which is so interesting a new thing which i found here which we found here of course if you enable this option if i try to open this app as you can see calculator isn't available at the moment why so if you click on this unquarantine app and then this should work which is basically named as freeze apps i'm not exactly sure basically if you enable this option for that particular app the app will not run in the background no battery drainage etc as far as i know not exactly sure but this is what i found if you take a look at the volume panel it's also changed a bit as you can see the background of this volume slider is having this hard kind of ui which was not available until the previous update with when i was using android 14 qpr1 update this is qpr2 beta 1 and these are the changes available in android 14's qpr2 you also have the remote authenticator unlock option in the fingerprint section unfortunately i also did not got this option i did not got this option too but we have all the screenshots and all thanks to the developers all thanks to michelle raymond for all the things which we found here like screenshots notification cooldown the the guy michelle raymond found this option in the on the pixel device and the thing is it could be i mean the menus right now is empty we are not having any kind of things written here but uh, not exactly sure what this will do but we'll let you know if we found something like that app info also has this new package option available so whenever you open app info you will see the package name of that particular particular app this is a very small change but that's a so useful thing i found this feature available in android 14 qpr2 update so if you use qpr2 let's check it out if it is available in your case or not but i think so it should be available there if you move on to system developer options one more thing which you will find here is a grammatical gender this is a new thing and it was it is available in the developer options so i'm not exactly sure what this feature will actually do to be very honest but the feature is available here so i just wanted to let you know you can access this by enabling developer options and if you did not enable them yet what are you doing right now we also have the private space option which is so impressive you have the option to enable this private space and as like some previous two or three features which i did not got on my device this is also one of them private space where you have the option to enable this thing and it will simply create a private space where you can hide the apps as far as i know or maybe you can also lock those apps too not exactly sure because i did not found this feature on my pixel device but could be the things like that other options are basically same like android 14 qpr1 update which which we've got some features etc etc if you want to know more about the features etc available in android 14's previous updates qpr1 update beta 1 beta 2 or maybe even the previous stable update video all the videos are available on my channel so far you can go and check it out and find out if something is really good for you all the things i just wanted to let you know i have already shared with you if you like this video don't forget to drop a like and also if you're new here don't forget to subscribe to the channel I will see you in the next one. Until then, goodbye and take care.